Welcome to The Reasons We Smile with Dr. Kavitko, the show that brings you man-on-the-street interviews, celebrity guests, groundbreaking research, and heartwarming stories about the reasons we smile. Our show is also known as everything you've always wanted to know about dentistry, but we're too numb to ask. Hello, I'm General Dentist Dr. Kavitko, and thank you for joining me today. The following views and opinions do not necessarily reflect those of this station, its staff, management, or parent company. To hear a replay of this show or one of the great shows that previously aired, log on to TheReasonsWeSmile.com or iTunes, keyword Dr. Kavitko or The Reasons We Smile. Listeners should not use Dr. Kavitko's comments and advice in place of an actual dental exam. Brighten your life with a smile that shows the professional touch of Dr. Kavitko. Time now for The Reasons We Smile with Dr. Kavitko. Call 459-9769 to discuss your dental issues. Now, here's your host, Dr. Kavitko. Hello, everyone. Welcome to The Reasons We Smile. I'm Dr. Hello, Kavitko. Everyone. Thank you so Welcome much for joining me. This is episode 680. Today with me on the phone, we'll bring him on in just a second, Today with is Gil Morlock, the COO of Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. He is live from, let's see, not Tempe, it is Scottsdale. I think the company is in Tempe, but he's in Scottsdale. So we'll bring him on in just a second. Uh, before we get started, let me remind you, if you'd like to follow me on Twitter, it's at Dr. Kavitko. And if you'd please go to my office Facebook page and like us, that would be awesome. Also, all past episodes complete with video are available at TheReasonsWeSmile.com and we're streaming live on Facebook. In about 10 minutes, you're going to have a chance to win free flowers from DeSantis Florist. They'll be delivered to your place of business this Tuesday afternoon. Let me give you the number now, but don't call yet because we're not ready for the question. But the number is 614-459-9769. 614-459-9769. So let me introduce or tell you a little bit about Mr. Gil Morlock. He is, well, let's put it this way. Last October 20 of 2020 was his 43rd year in dentistry. He started his formal education and became a certified dental assistant in the United States Air Force. His strong desires to be the very best enabled him to continue his education in every aspect of dentistry. His education was the foundation for a long and wonderful career that led him to develop vast knowledge in the operations of dental practices, development, and acquisitions. While in the military, he learned discipline, honor, and integrity. He became a problem solver and was quickly promoted to management positions, not to mention the numerous awards and medals for his contribution to the dental and medical field in the U.S. Air Force. He quickly learned how to work with and motivate a team to optimize proficiency by promoting successful proven strategies. He retired from the Air Force with honors and continued to develop his skills in practice acquisition, development, and communications. His achievements have led him to receive awards and recognition from numerous organizations, including the United States Air Force, Congress, and our 42nd President of the United States. His vision is to have a group of providers that have the reputation for quality dentistry, coupled with strong moral values supported by a great management team. Gil, good morning. Thank you so much for being on the show. Hill. Good morning. Thank, Thank you, you so much for being on the show. <laughs> for being on your show. So uh, that was a that's quite a nice resume <laughs> so you have there. And uh, what president a, is the forty nice second? Let me think. We just uh, uh, we just elected the forty sixth. Would that have been the first Bush? We just elected the forty sixth. No, which Bill Clinton. Bill Clinton. Okay, Clinton. Which? You know what? When Bill Clinton was president, I thought it would have been you know cool. What? Uh, I practiced in Clintonville. I, uh, my first office was on Clinton, uh, just across from Clinton Heights. And there, are across, there was Clinton Elementary right, right on that corner. And I thought it would be <coughs> kind of a neat uh, tie-in to say, hey, could you come to Clintonville and uh, talk to me? But I never asked. He probably wouldn't have been able to do it anyway. Right? <laughs> so you're the CEO of, Vi of Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. And um, <coughs> I know that it's formed about seven, eight months ago <coughs> I know yeah. and uh, so it's a culmination of a lot of work on your part and, uh, so and you're the driving force behind it correct on your part I am you're part the of the driving behind force it, behind it I'm very fortunate because we have visionaries as I as the name of the company is and we have a group of individuals that are phenomenal we have uh, some very experienced dentists in our board and uh, they advise us from that perspective and our CEO is actually a medical doctor, and he is very successful. He has had one of the most successful uh, groups in Arizona, 
there's the second largest uh, mobile medical group. Cool. So we have a very cool good team. Good. So it's actually uh, it's actually there's an acronym V A H I Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. And so basically, tell me what Vahi is. Basically, tell me what Vahi was started about seven months ago, eight months ago. And the purpose of Bahi was to look at these exceptional practices that are out there and that are, their owners are almost in the process of retiring. And in my visions a long time ago, I, I wanted to build a dental group that provided the best quality possible and also provided the best experience possible for the patients and had teams that had been with the doctors for a long period of time. Okay. When you have these combinations, you have okay. practices that people like to go to and also practices that are quite profitable. Okay. So, so you uh, look for these uh, okay. uh, successful so you, practices uh, look for these, and you look for doctors um, that are approaching retirement age and you say, hey, why don't you join our family? Okay. And the advantage to them of doing that Okay. Would be, and I know one is they no longer have be, the paperwork burden, correct? Yes, no exactly. That's a big one. Burden, More yeah. so than people realize. That's a big one. So I have a young yeah, associate so uh, who um, so I, I am grooming to do this uh, and who... Um, I'm I handing him this, more and more and of the uh, administrative type duties. In fact, we were on the phone yesterday because we had an instance where one of our dental assistants uh, uh, quit about a week and uh, three days ago, and she just was upset about something, and something about the way um, things went that day made her quit. But we couldn't figure out why she quit. She was very, uh, we, we loved her to death. She seemed to like us, but there was something that was keeping her from uh, from staying and then later not coming back. So yesterday, for several uh, minutes, maybe over an hour, we discussed this. He's been in touch with her, and you know, he he he. he she's returning. Let's put it that way. Happy story. Uh, she's returning. We never wanted her to leave in the first place, uh, but returning. he's learning that there's a lot more to be done than just dentistry. He's learning that there's a lot more to be done than just dentistry. So yeah. he's <laughs> spending his Saturday uh, massaging so this conversation with this young lady that we would uh, like to retain. And, and uh, I know that if either one of us had been the ones in charge and, uh, of that, that whole episode, she wouldn't have left in the first place. But as the doctor, we're usually doing root canals and extractions and crowns and implants, and we can't be there to... Uh, solve um, employee to, uh, uh, not disputes per se, but like when uh, when upset happens, se, you know, like, like the, the time to deal with it is right then. But I couldn't because I was doing root canal, you know. So yeah, he's <laughs> so he's learning. <laughs> so yeah, he's. <laughs> it is so very learning. difficult because uh, dentists they learn their craft, and it's not just technical; it's an art form. And in order to develop. To, like yourself, I mean, you 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 fall in our category as an exceptional dentist, and it has taken a lot of time, a lot of effort, and the wonderful thing about dentistry that is it's constantly changing and improving, right? And you cannot right. all of a sudden be sitting there doing an extraction and deal with uh, an issue, you know, with the staff or, or the facility or the equipment. You have to have a team that. That takes care of all of that right and, and that team has to be an alliance here's your word right, and that team with my value system what would dr kavitko have done what would dr kavitko have said in that instance right absolutely a lot of practices right? what happens is that they they don't invest in their team members so their team members are constantly moving from practice to practice one of the key elements in our search for practices is they have to have a history of being in that same practice for a long period of time. Mm -hmm. Well, you when know what? We... Oh, go ahead. Yeah. Go ahead. I don't no, want to no. interrupt. Well, you know what? Um, no, go, ahead. go ahead. Go ahead. <laughs> okay, wait a minute. Um, Three, two, one, you go. <laughs> okay. okay, wait a minute. What I was going to say two, one, is that go. we, in our evaluation process, when we purchase a practice, we do 375 line items of evaluation. And one of the key ones is that we take each individual and we assess their the expertise, and also how they communicate along with what do they do for the community. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 
what did they give? Oh, yeah. You know, what yeah. have they achieved in life? What is their passion? Right. Because if you don't, right. you end up eventually losing that person for a dollar race or two dollars race. Right. You know? So, you know, that's a really good point because then right. I instill in my so, people you know, how we really are going to give back. We've done Dentists from the Heart. We've done Team Smile events. We go to like churches and do back to school exams. We do things like touch a truck events and all these things where you can get out and meet people, you know, and help them in any way that we can, which, by the way, as dentists should be dentistry, right? Or at least close. Yes, absolutely. But what I was going to say when we did the three, two, one thing. But what I was going to say <laughs> was <laughs> I told Dr. Was Pagano, my, my associate, I told him this told the Dr. other day. Actually, Pagano, yesterday, I'll tell you what else I told him when we were talking about this young lady. Actually, yesterday, I'll tell you what else. Because he's still getting advice from me, and he's still trying to learn what I would do and what would be the best thing to say. And 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 so I told him, I said, okay, uh, here's one and, habit you've got to break. And, so I told and he him, goes, I said, what? I said, you've got to stop only doing one thing at a time. You've got to learn how to do three. Only doing but anyway, time. No, what I was gonna, what I told him was, but anyway, no, if you don't gonna, constantly was, recruit your people, if you someone else will. Recruit yes. your people, absolutely. So yeah. everybody has to feel valued. So they have to know you love having them. You have to have be interested. Not just pretend to be interested in their life, but be interested in their life. How are things going? How's your dad? Maybe their dad has cancer. How are things going? How's your dad? How you know what I mean? Uh, yes, I agree. How, the days you know I mean? of uh, hiring an individual and saying, well, they're here to, to work and I'm paying them to work, it, it's no longer valid because there's so many things that are going on right now in the world, and some of these things affect uh, your staff members. Mm -hmm. Especially, like, for example, the COVID situation. Mm -hmm. um, we had one individual, and I will not mention the individual's name, but their spouse ended up having COVID, and it was extremely stressful for for that individual mm -hmm. and we have to stay in mm -hmm. tune with the, with our team members and I can't say that enough we have to because they're human beings and uh, they if they don't have the same beliefs and the same culture or the same enthusiasm that you have then they don't fit in that team but you also just as they take care of you, you have to take care of them. Absolutely. And you know what, Gil? I'm looking at the clock and getting Absolutely. a nod from my producer. You know what, it's time for us to do Dr. Kavitko's question of the day. Before we do, I want to just remind people, uh, Gil is the COO of VAHI, VAHI. It stands for Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. And they are a group, they are uh, performed by a group of visionaries, and they are a group of very successful dental practices. Okay, just remember that. All right, before we do the contest, though, we'd like you to listen to this. This station right, will not be held liable like for any this. contesting during The Reasons We Smile with Dr. Kavitko. Participation in the contest allows Dr. Kavitko to record and broadcast your name and call. One winner per household, prizes are non-transferable, cannot be substituted, and are subject to taxes and fees. This station cannot be responsible for the inability to enter the contest, whether due to equipment malfunction or telephone difficulties. All decisions of Dr. Kavitko concerning this contest or eligibility are final. And now it's time for Dr. Kovitko's Question of the Day. All right, today we're talking with Gil Morlock, the COO of right, VAHI Vahi, known as Visionary v Alliance Healthcare Investments. Which of the following statements about Vahi is true? A. Vahi is an eyeglass company. B. Vahi is an ophthalmologic practice. C. Vahi was formed by a group of visionaries. D. Vahi is a group of very successful dental practices. Or E. Both C and D are correct. All right. The winner is going to receive free flowers from DeSantis Florist. They'll be delivered to your place of business this Tuesday afternoon. The number to call is 614-459-9769. That's 614-459-9769. So go ahead and call now. You won't believe it though. I want to hear your mind. And there's nothing else in the world tonight. She said people don't take the time. Hey, people don't take the time. 
Hi, this is Keith Carlos, former NFL player, actor, and first male winner of America's Next Top Model. I got a question for you. Do you know how many dentists there are between here and Los Angeles? Well, I don't know either, but I fly over every one of them just to see Dr. Kavico on a regular basis. Check out my smile courtesy of Dr. Kavico on my Instagram page, at Keith Carlos. Stay tuned to the reasons we smile with Dr. Kavico, the world's most compassionate dentist. Hi, I'm Dr. Kavitko. Are you tired of hearing what every business is doing to keep you safe? Well, me too, because they're all saying the same thing. Wearing masks, washing our hands often, and social distancing are the keys to keeping us healthy, and all businesses are doing that. But here at Dr. Kavitko & Associates, we do that and more. We have continuous air and surface pathogen reduction units inside our office that kill over 93% of the coronavirus and other pathogens. I bet you can't name another dental office that does that. Give us a call at 614-262-9588 or go to drkavitko.com. Dr. Kavicko, let's go! Yeah! Hi, I'm Johanna, and I've been a dental patient at Dr. Kavicko and Associates for over 10 years. I would really recommend Dr. Kavicko for your family's dental care. They're friendly, they're always there to help me. I feel like family when I walk in the door, it's clean, it's comfortable. Even if I have to bring my kids, they have a great playroom for them. I know when I'm with Dr. Kavicko, they are taking that extra time to make sure that I'm gonna be the healthiest I can be. They've been great, I love them. Call Dr. Kavitko and Associates today, 614-262-9588. Hi, this is Richard Simmons. Dr. Kavitko's here and he's gonna help you with all of your problems. Uh, are your teeth yellow? He can fix that. Are you missing a tooth? He can put a new one in. How is that? <laughs> That's very good, thank you, Richard. Okay, we're back. We're doing Dr. Kavitko's question of the day. We don't yet okay, have a winner, so either you're all asleep or I made the question too hard. I tried to make it easy for you, like E. I tried to make it anyway. easy for you, like E. Maybe because the name of uh, Visionary Alliance uh, Healthcare Investments is a long word and I used it a bunch of times. But yeah, we're going to leave the phone lines open. 614-459-9769. And uh, you will win free flowers from the Santa's Florist. We'll maybe bring you on the air when you call in and win. But remember, E is probably a good choice. All right, so we are with Gil Morlock. He is the CEO of of Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. It is a weird, kind of a tough thing to say, Gil. I don't know if you noticed that or not. Yes, it is. That's why we always call it Vahi. Oh, Vahi. Yeah, it's much easier. Okay. And and so tell people, you you guys are essentially a DSO, correct? Yeah. You guys are essentially DSO stands for Dental Service Organization, folks. But Gil, explain that to people. Uh, DSO is normally when you have um, individual providers or an entity that purchases, practices, and develops a dental group. Our DSO is different, though. It's completely different from all the DSOs. And I, being an office manager and being a practice developer, I've learned that sometimes when DSOs come in, and that's not all DSOs, but when they come in, they will purchase your practice. And then what they try to do is they try to implement their policies, their theories on practice development. Right. And people sometimes, in some right. DSOs, not all, will have a tendency to not be heard or um, not being represented. Right. Our, our process is just completely right. different from your average DSO. It sounds really cool. Uh, because what he's talking about, folks, is some really big cool. company. You've probably uh, seen it. You'll see a sign where the doctor had his name on, and then all of a sudden it says, you know, Premier Dental, and it's got his name in small letters. And now that's your sign, by the way, that he's sold. But the thing is, is I've heard cases where the new doctor comes in and uh on day one and um everybody quit all the employees quit why because they weren't listened to no they weren't involved in the discussion they weren't told of that the process was happening 
and I'm, the I've been uh, making, you know, my plan is and anyway, I'm, is to make sure been, that at uh, some point when I'm ready to, you know, step aside, that my staff has taken care of, their life isn't going to change very much, my patients shouldn't even know the difference because we're not going to be doing a bunch of different things. But, and so that vision, if you will, that idea that you guys use and are implementing, that's to me, perfect. That's perfect. Oh, by the way, folks, if you want to win free flowers, 614-459-9769. We'll make it easy for you so you don't even have to know the answer. We'll my tough question you. So you don't even have to is, how about we do a new question? Uh, are you listening to is, Dr. Kavitko on question? the reasons we smile uh, or not? Are you listening to Dr. <laughs> on so if you call 614-459-9769 and you say yes, you're going to win free flowers from DeSantis Flores. And you say yes, okay. you're going to win so free yeah, flowers from DeSantis Flores. Okay, so yeah, Gil, it sounds like you guys have it figured okay. out so yeah, because I have been contacted by a number of those other companies and I don't have any use for any of that. It's just, it's like, no, I don't want to do that. I, uh... I, I want to make that. sure that I, there uh, is no change, I that the transition sure is smooth, no change, um, and what you guys specialize smooth, in, from what I've read, um, is let's say there's a dentist who maybe does a lot of um, maybe they do a lot of implants and they want to keep doing a lot of implants because that's what they love you're not going to change that because they're successful their numbers prove it you might find another dentist who loves doing a lot of composite restorations or maybe they like doing porcelain veneers maybe they don't do any implants you're not going to make dentist number two start doing implants right any more than you make dentist number one start doing more veneers right right i agree with you the uh process that we look for or that we go through is we identify the individual practices culture and a lot of times people don't realize this but practice a and practice b can be massively successful but their culture how they react with the patients how they uh, do their work are completely different both practices are successful uh -huh. what, what we do is we say uh -huh. you pick up the torch and help carry your legacy forward because a lot of these individuals are at the stage in their life where they are thinking okay in about five years six years i'm going to have to retire right and i have developed and worked really right. hard to establish a very well-known practice that has a tremendous reputation it takes excellent care of their staff right and and I, as a dentist Right. I am at the top of my game. So we go in and we say, look, this is your practice. We respect that. Mm -hmm. And we will partner up with you. Partner up mm -hmm. with you means that even though we own the practice, they are still in the game and they have a lot of say so. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So if you're a dentist and you're approaching retirement age, yeah, listen to what Gil cool. just so said. Dentist, Even after they buy your practice, you Gil still have say. say. Even you still actually practice, tell me if I'm wrong, but I think you told me that the uh, senior doctor still gets to say yes or no to any new associate that's hired. Is that correct? Yes, sir. Okay, now see, that wouldn't happen anywhere else. I'm almost certain. Okay, we do have a winner. Let me uh, bring her on the line, on the phone here. Uh, Leona, how are you today? I'm fine, thank you. Good. So, do you know who you're listening to right now? Good. So, Dr. You know Kovac. Hey, right then she wins. <laughs> I, it was funny because I try to hear your show from wins. the very beginning every time. Yeah. And I turned it on late today and I go, well, I don't know what he's talking about or what the subject's yeah. going to be, but I'm just going to listen because I enjoy the show so much. And then you said, okay, the answer to today's question is yes. And I went, <laughs> okay, I'm calling you. I'm getting free but I did flowers. write you a note. Oh, thank you. I did write you a note I'm earlier about hearing flowers. your laughter is the best medicine. I don't know if you looked in your comments. I did. I did. I really, really appreciate that. I really appreciate that. You're welcome. Thanks I for did, keeping I such did. a positive really and upbeat that. show. Well, really thank you. That. So, Leona, stay on the line. We're going to get the information where to send you those flowers. Well, uh, just you. stay on hold. So and Leona, on Jim line. might have to come back and say, flowers, uh, call you so back later, but we will see. It looks like it's Jim time for me to go to another break. You're listening to The Reasons We Smile with Dr. Kavitko, and we'll be right back. You can take me as I am. just a little bit. This is Clark Kellogg. Stay tuned for more of Dr. Kavitko. Estás escuchando con Dr. Kavitko aquí en su sesión favorita. Hi, I'm Dominique Reigert. Like what you hear? Why not use the show to promote your product or service by becoming a sponsor? Call 614-262-9588 to learn how. That's 614-262-9588. Call now. 
Hi, I'm Dr. Kavitko, general dentist and host of the Reasons We Smile Radio and Roadshow. I've been honored to help several famous people get a perfect smile, like Keith Carlos and Dominique Rygaard from America's Next Top Model and Ted the Golden Voice Williams from right here in Columbus. Isn't it time you had a celebrity smile? It costs less than you might think, and most of the time, it can be done in one visit. A new smile can make a world of difference. Visit worldsmostinterestingdentist.com for more info about Dr. Kavitko. I'm Grandpa, and I go to Dr. Kavitko, and I still have all my teeth. Real ones. Burn my glasses. Okay, we're back. If you're just joining us, this is episode 680 okay, we're of back. The Reasons We Smile with Dr. Kavitko, and we have on the phone with us Gilmore Luck, COO of VAHI, which stands for Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. So we're almost out of time, Gil. I really uh, apologize for that, but so how, do you, how, how would a dentist reach you? How do you, do you guys have a website, an email address? How would you like to be reached? I would like to be reached. Just give me a call. My number is 480 eight four zero four zero three eight okay i'm gonna repeat that uh in my radio voice which i don't really have okay, I'm gonna uh, that. it's uh, four eight zero eight four zero four zero three eight wasn't that better folks no i shouldn't even be doing a radio show i don't even have a radio voice most of my guests have better radio voices than i do but anyway okay so is there anything we haven't covered in the last like two and a half minutes that you would like uh people to know anything we haven't covered yes uh we really people to have a concept that is is just phenomenal and one of the things that I wanted to share with you is that this is how serious we are about respecting our, our providers and their teams I have a rule and that is that none of my business partners executives uh, can go into a practice unless they have permission from the doctor okay even, even though we own the practice it's that kind of okay. uh, respect that we have for our team members and another thing is that we were evaluating a practice and the practice was worth more money than what the doctor was telling us. So we told them in our evaluations, we said, look, this practice is worth more. We will pay you what you're asking, but let's work together to also get you more money in paying you more for what, that, what the practice is worth. So well, we're coming from a completely different way of looking at things. That sounds unheard of as well. <laughs> well it's called integrity that yeah oh that's that's well. an awesome word and yeah i, I have that and uh, yeah. oh, that's, i want to work with people awesome who have that and, yeah, I, and I so that. it's nice to know there's a, a somebody else in the game the dso so game that nice maybe actually has a, integrity because i have been contacted by several companies over time and i wouldn't I work with uh, well i wouldn't work with any of them because i haven't you know what i mean because it's just uh it's just all they want to come in, do is come in and change things, squeeze every uh, penny out of everything and, and leave the doctor kind of like on the sideline. So that's really awesome. I'm really happy that you guys have entered that uh, that realm and, and the marketplace. So again, if you're a dentist, it's called Visionary Alliance Healthcare Investments. And Gil's phone number is 480-840-4038. And so I only have a little bit of time left, and uh, Leona, the winner of our flowers, I, 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 I saved this time because I was going to make an announcement, which I guess I will, although she's making it hard. Um, next week, next week's show, January 31st, is going to be my last show broadcast over the air. It's not a Sunny 95 thing, it's just I'm not going to be broadcasting over the air. Uh, who knows, maybe Gil will want to re, uh, reinvigorate that or bring that back in some way. Uh, but... Uh, I'm probably still going to be doing podcasts, so you can still check the reasons we smile dot com and see my latest show. But um, I'm trying to spend more time with my grandkids, and you know the timing and that sort of thing. So it looks like I'm out of time. I'm getting the 30 second spot, which, by the way, looks like the letter C for those of you that aren't in radio. <laughs> so it's time to say. And so be sure to tune in 
next week then for my last show. It'll be kind of so like a bittersweet, saying, but so it, it is what it is, right? Week, then, for my last okay, show. so be sure to tune in next week right here. Oh, I want to make sure. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter. Go to my Facebook page and like us. It's Dr. Kovitko and Associates. Remember that all past episodes complete with video are available at TheReasonsWeSmile.com. Be sure to tune in next week and every week right here on your favorite station. Goodbye. Be sure to tune in next week. This is Carly Red from Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, the hit show on VH1, urging you to tune in next week with my dentist, Dr. Kavitko. If you're interested in learning more about this and other dental health topics, go to TheReasonsWeSmile.com to access full episodes of Dr. Kavitko's show. If you'd like Dr. Kavitko, the world's most interesting dentist, to speak at your next event, please call 614-262-9588. That's 614-262-9588 or send an email to speaking at... Can he, uh, can he call you back when the, um, um,